a butt tuba. Oh, I see it. Yeah, you see? It's like it mirrors itself. People who are masters of palindromes can create some of the most epic speeches of all time. Yeah. It's like, you think oh, stuff God, like haiku that. is difficult? <sighs> can you imagine a haiku with palindromes in it? <laughs> oh, God. That I would like to read. <laughs> oh, shit, that's the nail. I almost got it, I'm dead. Of course I would find this. Just for the record, if you want a better example of a palindrome, Mem is a palindrome, by all technicalities. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait, if you take something, leave. reverse it halfway through like that, yeah, you've just created your own jerry-rigged palindrome. <laughs> Technically, you're not gonna get any points on your English paper for it, but <laughs> no, um, Chernoni, not not Novi, Nova. No way, I think it's correct. I thought it was pronounced Chernone. You know, Nason. Oh yeah. Yeah. Just <laughs> Churros. Okay, I'm calling you. I, I'm sure. I'm calling you Churro. Churro. Oh my God, that's what we called. Back when I was in the Possessed by Phoenix livestream, oh my god. That's what we called Cherno. Churro. <laughs> nice. Why you do that, Cherno? Oh yeah, um, no Because but. we were young and we were stupid. <laughs> the reason that some, someone once, uh... Oh my god, I cannot forget this. I was talking with my friends, uh, it was actually today. But it was hilarious. I started talking with them, and we were talking about the personalities of the people. Now, I did, I, we made a fucking... One of my friends made a waffle sketch in the middle of class. <laughs> and it was basically a freaking uh... Uh... It was a waffle spoof on bleach. It was hilarious, oh. but... Anyway... To get to it, we were talking about the personalities of all the characters, and then we we got to Cherno. Oh god, we got to Cherno. Our excuse, you do? we're like, Cherno's such a, Cherno's such a, per, such a nice per character, the fur is just nice. And one of my friends likes, is like, obsessed. Like, literally, you'll see every, you'll have picked, he has freaking his phone case, has a customized 9 on it. That's actually pretty awesome. <laughs> uh, it's a customized not a nine Attention. phone case. And uh, anyway, his home screen and lock screens are nine. It's scary. Anyway, <laughs> what, uh, he he says no no no. There there is no possible reason that Cherno has. <laughs> there is no disorder that Cherno has to make her stupid. And we're like, okay, then you explain her background. <laughs> She was oh, hanging boy. out with the wrong crowd. What do you mean? She was hanging out with Marisa. She knew Marisa before. Oh, boy. What, I forget oh, yeah, who it no. is, but I, I forget who it was. One of my friends also said something about how, how apparently she would have, uh, she had like brain damage or something, or from being hit on the head by being dropped or something. I don't know. What? Cherno Apparently and Marissa friend, together friend, sounds like a bad crack pairing when you ask them. Like Cherno was dropped on the head as a child. Are you kidding me? No, no. You want to know why Cherno comes off as <laughs> dumb, okay? It's because she's a fucking fairy. <laughs> Fairies aren't too clever. Most, God bless their souls. She's not the most informed fairy. <laughs> I know she's so, not anyway, oh boy. I know she's Before not I said stupid, it, I said it, okay? Oh, I know. I know that. Just joking around. She's oh shit. I see we all. And frankly, anyway. okay, part of me just if I were to ever find go into Gensokyo, the first thing I would do is go find her and then out of nowhere just give her a hug. <laughs> 
just randomly. Oh, hi there, stranger. Hug. What was that for? I don't care. You are the strongest, I are you? I don't think you're an idiot. Just that I don't think you're the idiot. I think you're the strongest. <laughs> I think you're the strongest for putting up with all of their shit. Oh yeah, definitely. America, we oh, say go see that waffle sketch. Has anybody seen that waffle sketch? Uh, <laughs> air, uh, no. uh Raymond. <laughs> 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 I just imagined the John Tron version of that. Bad touch, bad touch, stranger danger. <laughs> oh boy. Oh, uh, Nova. Uh, what? Does that design ask me something, MVM? Uh, yeah, sure. I can stay up late tonight. I don't have school tomorrow or uh, today. John Tron visits so so cute. Every his entire theme is composed of ick. <laughs> Oh boy. It's the new language, it's the second part of dot 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 language. Oh god. <laughs> don't don't bring up caretaking, god damn it. <laughs> okay. Uh someone actually said before when I mentioned it, can you say it after it? Uh there was the uh Waffa's sketch my friend made in the middle of class, sadly. Uh. Oh, it was a freaking it was a bleach spoof. It was like on the first episode, and it's that part where you see like Odihime and all of her friends sitting in the sitting in the yard eating. It, uh, guess who was Odihime at that point? Who? Adult Rumia. Hey. All of a sudden, you just see <laughs> you just see uh freaking I for, I think it was Deuce was uh. The girl who said it, but it was, uh, it was also, she's like, yeah, I love cake, and it's like, how do you not get fat, uh, no, Chirino goes, uh, uh, no, yeah, Chirino goes, how do you not get fat from that? Deusy goes, it must, go, um, all the fat from it must go to right to her boobs. 